I had to install some shower anise trim. I'm using Schluter Metal Profile, and I like to mark those using a Pika Dry Pencil and use a 2x4 as a support so that when I cut it with my miter saw, it won't kick back. You can see these miters are nice and tight. And then I applied thin set to the bottom using a margin trowel, and then I used a quarter inch by 3 8 inch square notch trowel to apply more thin set and embedded the profile made it flush with the tile. Now here's a huge tip. Inside the shower niche, this is a prefab niche, I made sure that the tile was butted up against that so that when I add the metal profiles, they're going to be nice and flush with the tile and have tight miter joints. Now, if you're doing a similar project like this and you're stressed out, join our Platinum membership where you can watch this full tutorial and many more over at homerepairtutor.com.